are you getting error code 4 in Adobe Premiere Pro? We have you covered. Here is how to fix it. Before we move forward, do us a favor by subscribing to our channel and liking this video. It's free and helps us a lot. We do tons of research trying to find the working solutions for you. Your little support will help us continue making solution videos for you and others. Now let's get started. Method 1. You mostly get Adobe Premiere Pro error code 4 if you are running out of storage. So the first thing you need to do is free up some disk space. If you have some unnecessary project files in Premiere Pro, you can delete it. For that, open Premiere Pro project and click on the file tab. Select close project option. Next go to edit and select preferences. Click on media cache and click on the delete button beside remove media cache files option. Click on delete unused media cache files and click on the ok button to confirm. You can also choose to delete all media cache files and click on ok. Now Premiere Pro will automatically shut down. Launch it again. Method 2. If you have multiple storage units, the next thing you can do is change their export location to another drive that has enough space. To do that, go to the Exports tab and click on the link beside Location. Next, browse to a folder on your second drive. Then click on Save to set the export location. Method 3 the next thing you can do to free up disk space is clean up the recycle bin. So just right click on the recycle bin icon on your desktop and click on empty recycle bin option. Method 4. You can also free up your disk space using disk cleanup. For this, type disk cleanup in the window search bar and select the top option. Select the drive from where you want to clean all the junk files. Click on the OK button. Next click on the Cleanup System Files option and the cleanup process will start. Wait till the scan completes. Once done, select the files you want to delete. Then click on OK. Now launch Adobe Premiere Pro and this time you should not get the error. So that's it. Subscribe to our channel and get quick solutions to all your tech issues. Join our Facebook group where you will get direct help on everything tech. Leave a comment and help others know which solutions solved your problem. Thanks for watching and always remember that we are here to help you out.